Authorities are investigating a deadly fire on the city's southeast side. Firefighters were called here to this home on Five Points Road around 8 a.m. Several neighbors made 911 calls telling the fire department they believed a woman was trapped inside. The department has now released those calls and tonight we're starting to learn more about the people who tried to help. Fox 59's Courtney Spinelli spoke with one of those witnesses and shares what she learned. Can everyone get out safely? I don't know. No one is coming to the door. No one is a, getting it. You know, okay. we yes, can't so get anyone's yes, attention. Monday morning, multiple callers phoned 911 to let emergency responders know there was a house fire on the city's southeast side. We've knocked on the windows and everything. I don't know if anybody's in there or not, but it's it's okay we do have them on the way over there okay the indianapolis fire department now releasing the calls for help as neighbors and passerbys work to get to anyone who might be inside initial callers reported seeing smoke coming from the roof of the structure uh, subsequent callers reported heavy flames frantic moments can be heard as witnesses realized there was a woman who lived in the home who hadn't come out there's a house fire is there anybody that lives here where's she at ma'am we can't get into the house. It's all it's fully engulfed. Ma'am. They said there's somebody in the house. Samantha Morales was passing by, driving her five-year-old son to school when she saw the smoke and flames. She didn't want to speak on camera, but says she ran over to help a neighbor who was trying to get inside to find the woman. Another 911 caller can be heard describing what she saw. Sorry, there's somebody trying to throw a rock into the house. Morales told me they were able to break through the glass, screen, and wooden grids by throwing landscaping rocks, but the smoke became too overwhelming. As the sirens roared in the background, she says they realized they had done everything they could. People on scene insisted that she was still in the structure, and uh, firefighters had a difficult time accessing the structure due to the extreme clutter conditions inside the residence. And as they arrived at school, Morales' son told her he wanted to pray for the family and the woman who didn't make it. She wants them to know there were people there doing everything they could to hope for a better outcome. Reporting on the southeast side, Courtney Spinelli, Fox 59 News. Mm, Morales says she wishes the outcome was different, but wants the family to know how much their neighbor did in those moments. And she says she'd do the same if she ever found herself in that position again. As for the cause of this fire, investigators say a space heater is to blame.